June, Governor Andrew Cuomo signed an executive order that would require police departments to have community input on policies and procedures. If they didn't, they could risk losing their local funding. Only on to Mayor Gary Herzig and Police Chief Douglas Brunner proposed a community advisory board that was approved by Oneonta's Common Council. Shalon Stevens spoke with Herzig about that new community advisory board. The community advisory board will have nine members. They will be proposed by Mayor Herzig and approved by the Common Council members. We've defined the membership. Uh, the membership of the board. Uh, will include uh, representatives from the Oneonta chapter of the NAACP. It will include representatives from our Commission on Community Relations and Human Rights. Uh, we want our college students represented, uh, both Hartwick and student, uh, Hartwick and SUNY Oneonta. Uh, and we want um, a faculty uh, and staff from both colleges represented as well. An Oneonta council member will also be represented. Their charge is to work with the police chief in reviewing all of our policies, our procedures, our training, and um, uh, make recommendations for any possible changes to make sure that all of our um, procedures are have safeguards against bias uh, sneaking in uh, to make sure that uh, all of our procedures uh, do everything they can to eliminate the risk of excessive force. Oneonta Police Department is one of the smallest departments in New York State to be accredited. Herzig says having the people of this city review their policies and procedures will help the department be the best they can be. Reporting, Shalon Stevens, Eyewitness News.